everybody knows that candy bars are great for being wrapped on a flow wrapper. But did you know that there's many other products and ways where a flow wrapper can help your business? I'm Greg Bergeek, Vice President of Sales and Marketing at Pack Machinery, and today I'm gonna to teach you a little bit more about some of our flow wrappers. When people think of a flow wrapper, they usually think of a high-speed machine, right? I'm doing 100, 200, 300 a minute, going really, really fast. And, and it's true, there are a lot of benefits for a flow wrapper doing that. But let, let's back it up a bit. What are you usually doing before that? Usually you have something like a vertical or horizontal band sealer, doing it one at a time, really slow, maybe six a minute, a couple hundred an hour, and that's fine for a little bit. But what happens when you get that big contract or you want to expand your distribution? This is where a flow wrapper works great for individually wrapping a products. Flow wrappers, you know, food items are fantastic. We, we mentioned candy bars or, or energy bars. Uh, we also see it with snacks, like cracker snacks and things like that. Um, you see it with ice cream, uh, popsicles, chocolate. I mean, there's a lot of different things that a flow wrapper can be in. And, and there's a lot of different options for flow wrappers, right? We got, we got brushes, we got formers. I mean, really the first thing when, when buying a flow wrapper is to understand the range of products that you want to wrap in there. And, and please don't tell us, yeah, we want to do everything. Let's focus on what the key products are. Let's get an understanding of what's going to have the most impact for your business, and then we can go from there. That, that's truly how you buy an optimal flow wrapper. You know, you, you're doing changeover, but always good to, to minimize that and be realistic about what the organization is capable of. I mean, these are pretty powerful, high-performance packaging machines. You know, a, a lot of, of times people come to us for a flow wrapper are startup operations, right? That's not uncommon. Uh, here you see some pecan pies. This was a customer that uh, th their business was growing and they, they want us to grow with them. And then, you know, medical products and injection molded parts. Those are also great for a full wrapper. You see our twin jaw version for high speed output. So there's a lot of things and, and people come to us and they, they come with one type of idea of equipment that they want and we're able to gear them. You know, they might want a bagger to start with or a band sealer, but really a flow wrapper makes more sense. You know, these units have touchscreen interfaces, which is great. Here I'm highlighting our FW400F flow wrapper. Our 400F is, is extremely versatile. You know, you can put a thermal transfer printer on there for nutritional information and other things that, you know, variability of, uh, of print on the product. Uh, you can also put a date, a hot stamp date lock code printer, which is very economical and, and simple to use. Uh, you can add uh, gas flush on there, right? So nitrogen flush for extending the shelf life of your products. Uh, nitrogen is great, you take the oxygen out. Uh, you can get extremely low uh, residual oxygen levels with the flow wrapper. I think in this video, we're doing less than 0.1%, which is you know, you overkill many applications, but you know, you're ensuring maximum freshness of your product, which you, know, you, you put a lot of effort into making this product. You want it to stay fresh for as long as possible. Another option that you can look at for flow wrappers is our water cool transfer plates with the water chiller. You think about wrapping of ice cream bars or chocolate or things that will melt with heat, right? These, these plates are hot. Uh, with this option, as you see in this video, we've been able to reduce the temperature of the plates by over 100 degrees, right? So nice and cool. Your product doesn't get damaged in any way. And uh, you maintain that nice appearance, especially when wrapping uh, products that melt. All this is available on our 400F flow wrapper. You know, a lot of people when they're using a flow wrapper, a lot of benefits can come just by packing by hand, right? I mean, everybody thinks automation, that's great, but you know, hand packing can work really great. I mean, I know you see a lot of people in this video, but I think they, they calculated their, their labor costs on this based on the output was around a cent per package. So you can do a lot, especially you know, if you have uh, a lot of changeover or different products, right? So automation is great for high volumes of things, but if, if you have changeover, uh, you know, an operator or two in the process will we'll work really, really well for that. And also something you see here is that the crackers are in trays, right? That makes it really easy to run on the flow wrapper as opposed to being individually, uh, individually wrapped up. And, and these crackers are great. I don't know if you've had them, but they are, they are exceptional. While the 400F is, is, can't work with automation, we usually bump people up to our 450S, the all servo driven machine. Here you see a card feeder doing that. With, with the servo, you know, you're running over 200 packs a minute. 
Uh, it's great for feeding systems or a combination of a feeder and a person in between uh, to really get that, uh, that higher production output, which is extremely important. The 450S also has a no product, no bag feature, which makes it easier for the operator to load. You see here the operator, you know, he's not putting a product in every lug, and that doesn't matter because the, the, the machine actually has sensors that will detect when, when, the, uh, when the infeed is fully loaded and will make products. In this case, it's actually doing it at a rate of about 100 a minute, but it's starting and stopping because of the loading. So no product, no bag really makes it easier on your operators to load and uh, great for any type of automation that you desire. I should also mention with the 450S, given that it's all servo, storing of a job parameters, you can store a lot more parameters, which makes changeover much easier, especially if you have something like our deluxe adjustable former for wrapping the products. Now, not everybody needs this high speed. A lot of people come to us entry level. Here you see our 350T flow wrapper. That is a tabletop or on a stand type wrapping machine. Uh, it goes you know, I think it does something like uh, over 3,000 packs an hour, which is good in many applications. Uh, and, and then, you know, people come to us, they, they want a flow wrapper for like ice cream bars. We get that all the time, but we look at the volume and we look at the ROI, and, and sometimes that just doesn't make sense, right? You don't want a machine that's just running for a couple hours a month. So enter in uh, our automatic baggers. Here you see our roll bag R785. It's doing about half the speed of the, uh, the 400F but very flexible uh, and uh, able to give the customer the output at a fraction of the cost. So, you know, with pack machinery and, and our broad range of products, we're really able to steer you and your customers to the optimal packaging solution, not just what they think they need. So our, our sales consultants certainly help in that process once we've identified the goals of your project. And this is an overview of our range of flow wrappers from pack machinery. Now I look forward to taking some of your questions.